Bloody half your five ever laid eyes on. It's not just in pain. It's trying to sing. It's the song of the sands. We don't normally sing like this underground. Is that what's causing the storm? Aye. Judging by all this hive matter weighing it down, it's been trapped here for dozens of winters. Don't worry, Lunch. We'll get you out. What is that name? Well, the last squid thingy we saw was Diener, so... Oh, boy. While I appreciate the attempt at humor, that little brother is truly awful workplay. Embarrassing, really. Oh, well, can't all be winners. There's got to be a way to clear those rocks. Get a better angle. Looks like it can move now, but it still can't get out. Much of the hive matter is gone. We can free it from the surface now. <sighs> Why did they trap it down here? Hafgifers are known to burrow. I'd hesitate to place full blame on our dark elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the dark elves. Any more than the light belongs to the light elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources. One the elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the light elves seem keen to banish the hive over on their side, the dark elves make effective use of it out here in the barrens. So, by clearing out all of this hive, Hurting Dark Elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved? No. Then let us free.
We can cut the half goofa loose here. It flies? Of course it flies. It's a half goofa. Sounds much happier now. And hey, the storm's gone. Aye. Perhaps we'll finally earn some goodwill from our Dark Elf friends after all. Look, Father, thanks for bringing us out here, but you don't have to do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered... He just wants to spend time with you, lad. While he still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead. But if Ragnarok approaches... I wish to enjoy the time we have left. I... I don't know what to say. Thank you... for bringing us out here. I'm glad we did this. As am I. Brother, you ever think of cooking meat with those blades of yours? No. They would foul the meat. Oh, because of the magic on them? The blood. Ah, yes. Carry on then. Back to Thor and Odin's stories? Where were we? Okay. There was Thalmor, the stonemason. Aye. He quarreled with his son. Went into the night to find him. Found Thor instead. And there was Thalmor's son, Grimthor. Who built the walls of Asgard. And whispered something of importance to Freya before his betrayal and assassination. Enough. We will continue later. I hope Tyr's had enough time to find his equilibrium, or whatever. Indeed. I saw flashes of the old god of war in him, but they were fleeting. There is nothing wrong with opposing war, nor opposing prophecy. I suppose that's fair. Never can be quite sure what the giants meant by any of it. Am I the only one that remembers they predicted our entire journey to Jotunheim? If the giants saw Tyr leading armies at Ragnarok, then I believe them. The question is, how you'll ever make Tyr believe it. Master Kratos, I would speak with you. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. All that said, I'm happy to discuss anything else on your mind. Ah, glad to see you back, young one. Come help me, won't you? Oh. 
Sure. We can eat whenever you like, Kratos. The stew will only improve with time. Glad you're in a better mood. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. I was a little overwhelmed before. Forgive me. It's funny. Nothing seems to settle my mind quite like cooking. Mm -hmm. Being locked up for so long. Dress. Eat. Oh, careful. Careful. Thank you. Enjoy. Enjoy, my friends. Yeah. We'll see about that. Here you are. A meal fit for a champion. Enough. I said we would speak no more of that. Yes, of course. No. Didn't mean to offend. Uh, I'm not offended. It's just a word. The word didn't cloud your judgment. So, you really don't think it means anything? After the journey Mom sent us on? Everything we saw in Jotunheim? What was it all for? Don't you ever think about that? Every day. But I cannot believe her purpose was to inspire you to take foolish risks. But what if the giants are counting on me? What giants? I'm counting on you. To be safe. To be smart. But... Use the judgment of a man and not of a child. But what if Loki going to Ironwood is the only way that... <gasps> oh, Atreus. My son. I'm not hungry anymore. Forgive me, Kratos. My words were chosen carelessly. You really should eat. Some people swear by it. On almost a daily basis. I just don't understand. Why is there all this stuff about Loki and, and the champion and Ironwood if none of it's real? He's just so... Mind if I give you the best advice you've heard all day, and possibly ever? Sleep. That's when all the troubles of your mind work themselves out. Sure. Fine. Sleep? Sounds great. I mean it. I do too. Get out of here, Heidi. Already gone.
What are you? I wish I'd known I was a god in Alphon. I wouldn't have felt so bad about killing so many elves. What's going on? Was that a mask? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Where am I? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Feel something about it or shut up or it. Little people's little We're problems. We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems. Memories. And not nice ones. You broke the gate. That was our only way to Yonahan. What do you want? Let's go, Duma! I don't understand. Whatever. 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 Hey, whatever. don't run whatever. off! Whatever. Can whatever. you tell me whatever. where I am? Whatever. 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 Will you stop? I gotta get out of here. should pay for what he said about mother. Oh. <clears throat> but we're God. We oh. can do whatever this. we want. Please. Please wait. Please. Oh. Why is this happening? This is a much better knife than Mother's. Please, stop! Where are you going? <coughs> Follow you? Okay. Guess I'll see you around the other side. <coughs> Where am I? Can you understand me? Oh. Hi there. So, where are we going? <coughs> Got it. I was having the weirdest dream and just kind of woke up here. Is this Ironwood? Any idea how I got here? I dreamt my way here? I mean, suppose I must have. I'm here. Scent? What scent? Oh, that might be Fenrir you're smelling. Wish you were here to meet you. <laughs> There's a lot of you, huh? What's that smell? The air here, it's... I don't know. Sweeter? Maybe it's these trees. Ah! <laughs> you tell me if you were gonna eat me. <laughs> That's a joke, right? I, 
I've never seen a forest like this before. Through here? I'm not finished with it yet. <gasps> the paint is made from the bark of the ironwood trees. They absorb the memories of the forest so that the paint remembers too. Memories of the past. Of the future. I'd hate to get blood on it. Well, it's really you. Uh, you know who I am? What's wrong? I've been... Waiting my whole life for this moment. Huh. You look weirder than I imagined. Oh. Sorry. <sighs> um, was that mean? Kind of. Damn it. I'm already messing this up. <laughs> it's just you're the first person that I've talked to in a very long time. And weird can be good. Uh, thanks. Let's start over. I'm Angoboda. You must have a lot of questions. Uh, yeah, where Follow are me. We? You'll get your answers soon enough. Well, some of them. When you said you knew me... Like I said, you'll get your answers soon enough, Loki. Er, right. Is that not your name? No. It is my name. I'm Loki. Ah. Oh. 